uh, nephrotoxicity can happen as a result of medications. It can happen as a result of IV uh, intravenous contrast that patients can get to monitor. Um, so ultimately, um, patients who have had uh, a radical nephrectomy, especially if they do need uh, systemic chemotherapy uh, delivered by an oncologist, some of these um, chemotherapeutic agents can cause direct toxicity to the remainder kidney. Um, on top of that, um, if they had some underlying chronic kidney disease in the past and their risk factors, which I mentioned before, are high, high blood pressure, diabetes, are not controlled, they can develop further damage to their remainder kidney or remainder whatever is left of their, of their kidney mass. Um, and so um, ultimately, uh, nephro we have to manage their um, different medications and different dosing of medications to prevent further toxicity to their remainder kidney. Um, in addition to uh, chemotherapies, certain pain medications such as NSAIDs or non-steroidal anti-inflammatory medications, they take that for pain after surgery, that can also further affect their, their remainder kidney. Um, so we have to um, you know, work together with the urology team, the oncology team, um, to, to kind of um, come up with a reasonable plan to protect the kidney function as much as possible.